Stand up straight, Hubble. Where on? I can't. This watermark logo is too big. Whoa, that is big. I think it's even bigger than the one on the Diet Love episode. Only by a bit. What do I do? Uh, can you push it back up into the corner? I'll give it a try. <laughs> there, done. Good. Now we can get on with the show. <laughs> It's official, Snitch. I'm going to London. Just got the letter from Hogwarts. Isn't that the skin condition that pigs get? No, you're thinking of Hogwarts. Oh, right. I used to hate those things, but then they kind of grew on me. So how are you going to get there? Easy. I'll catch the tube. You? Tube? You're right, Snitch. I'll check on YouTube for the timetable. Uh, there's a lot of Selena Gomez videos in the history search. Here's one about her trying to find a new boyfriend. Oh! <laughs> Don't worry. It's probably only a rumour. Oh, that's why I'm crying. Selena and Justin break up. Selena at the beach. Selena sings in Russian to piglets. Snitch, have you been on the computer again? <laughs> uh, don't know what you mean. I've been reading this book all day. Oh, drat. Now there's an ad come up. Tired of telling jokes that no one laughs at? Well, now you don't have to stop telling them with new canned laughter. It says you can skip the ad in five seconds. Wait, I don't skip just, that. Just click there. What? I can't. No, Wait, there. No, you get off. No, let me out. the correct term is TV characters of abundant chromaticity. I had no idea we've been around for that long. I think it's time to get on the old blower and find out the origins of this old film. Calling Toonie! Come in Toonie! That whip, Tony. Now listen, you don't know anything about some old film of Hubble and I, do you? It's in the link we sent you. Well, thanks for taking a look for us, Tony. Give our regards to everyone at Toonsmith Studio and crack that whip extra hard for us. Let's get Trog on the line. I bet he'll know what the old footage is all about. Good thinking, Snitch. 
Paging Trog, where three G's and the middle G is silent. Come in, Trog. Ah, hey, hey, Hobble and Snitch, my two favourite goblins. Uh, uh, my condolences for the recent loss of your king. Yeah, thanks, Trog. Look, we're calling because we found this old, old film of us online. Do you know anything about it? Because we certainly don't. Right, right, yes, hmm. Well, uh, actually, I once found an old box of uh, videotapes washed up on the beach. Now, uh, these tapes contained archival footage of, uh, let's see, there was a bath mat monster, a, uh, a man with a pencil for a nose who lived on the moon, and uh, there was a fluffy pink ostrich in there as well. <laughs> you just described our last office party, but I doubt it was that. I had those tapes erased. Right, well, now the interesting thing is there was a fourth tape. Now the fourth tape actually featured footage of two goblins. Trog, that was us, I'm sure of it. But I didn't realise the two goblins were actually you. Do you remember entering a contest of any kind? There was that 1995 National Limbo Championships, but I lost that to Horrida's uncle, Fernando Winslow. He wanted me to enter too, but I could never stoop that low. Well... I wish you the very best of luck. I hope you find what you're looking for. Okay, thanks for looking into it for us, Trog. It's no use, Snitch. We'll never know what that old film was all about. And neither of us can remember that far back either. You know what they say, memory loss is the first sign of... of... something or other. Oh no. There will always be this big space missing in our memories. Hobble, that's it. It is? Sounds rather miserable to me. No, no, no. I mean space. Let's ask Captain Ebo of shipwreck fame. He's up there in space looking down on everything. Surely nothing has escaped his eagle eyes. Aye. Aye, aye? No, he only has one eye. Yeah, I know. <coughs> Calling Captain Ebo deep, deep in space where no one can hear you scream. With laughter. I think it's all canned laughter up there. Hey, Captain Ebo, what do you know about that old footage? Well, there's a lot of wormholes out there in space, guys. The Star Blazer has to try to avoid them all the time. Yeah, I know what you mean. We have mouse holes no. down here in the cave. No, the wormholes are a gateway to other dimensions. I think the goblins in that old footage are from another dimension. <laughs> Don't be silly, Captain. That's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. Wormholes in space, in an alternate hobble and snitch, in an alternate dimension. <laughs> <laughs>